everyone. Welcome back to Two Idiots Review. I'm Caleb. I'm Hannah, and it's early, and the Marvel's Avengers 4 official trailer dropped <laughs> yeah, about an hour ago, but I had like, just gotten out of the shower, and I was like, oh, well, we're going to have to wait, because <laughs> we were expecting it to be 6, and then it dropped at like 5. Yeah, so like, I had texted her, I was like, um, the trailer's here, and she's like, well, you're going to have to wait, and I was like, no! <laughs> Um, but yeah, so, I mean... But that's enough, let's just get into it. <laughs> oh, uh, but don't forget to subscribe, like our channel. We did a reaction to Captain Marvel, which was earlier this week. We're going to be doing a reaction to Spider-Man, assuming that it and drops tomorrow. And the Avengers game, and... And everything else, so just Marvel subscribe, game, Avengers, like, but comment. Whatever. We're Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. Hey, Miss Potts. If you find this recording, don't feel bad about this. Part of the journey is the end. Just for the record, being adrift in space with zero promise of rescue is more fun than it sounds. Our food and water ran out four days ago. Oxygen will run out tomorrow morning. Oh. That'd be it. Where was Thor? Why didn't he come and save them? When Where is Nebula? Off, I will dream about you. <laughs> it's always you. Alright. Well, <laughs> Scarecrow. Reference to the comics. Thanos did exactly what he said he was gonna do. He wiped out 50% of all living creatures. We lost, all of us. We lost friends, we lost family. Ronin, slash Hawkeye. <laughs> we lost a part of ourselves. Yes. This is the fight of our lives. <laughs> so oh. That's a piggy thing. This is work, Steve. I know it is. Because I don't know what I'm going to do if it doesn't. No beard this time? No. Yeah. Come on, the, the title. What's the title? What is it? Endgame. Endgame. Well, that's a little. That's what everybody thought. I know. <laughs> it was between that and Annihilation. Hi, uh, is anyone home? This is Scott Lang. We met a few years ago at the airport. Is this an old message? Ant-Man? <laughs> Ant-Man, I know you know I know you know that. It's the front door. That's me. Can you buzz me in? <laughs> <sighs> so much mistaken. <laughs> well, first of all, it was a lot longer of a trailer than I was expecting. I thought it was gonna be like a 45 second of nothing and then maybe announce the title and like that was gonna be it. <laughs> but no, they actually showed a bunch and we got the title. Which, I mean, they showed a bunch, but at the same time, they didn't really show anything. Like, there was no, like, there was no, like, action <laughs> well, sequences. No there was no... Of, yeah, like, it was all just, like, conversation happened. and stuff. Like, Iron Man's floating in space, about to die, because he's about to run out of air, food, and water. And who knows why he's floating in space, and when that takes place. <laughs> yeah, and then, like, you have Captain America and Black Widow, who are just sitting at the compound, like, well, now what do we do? <laughs> and, and he still has his Peggy watch. <sighs> But, I mean, yeah, so that showed, I mean, it wasn't, it didn't show as much as, like, the first Infinity War trailer that dropped, because, like, that had, like, showed, like, a lot of, like, you know, action sequences and fights and wars. Like, this was just more of, like, everyone was just kind of, like, I, I don't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> and then, of course, Ant-Man comes in with a little comic relief <laughs> at the end. Um, yeah, so, because, you know, as we saw in the end of Ant-Man and the Wasp, he's stuck in the quantum realm. Um, but he's so, out. <laughs> but, obviously, he finds some sort of time vortex and... Or something, because they didn't mention something. that. Um, or he just finds his way out. But That could, that could be, I mean, that, that little hint there could have been just something to set up for future movies that doesn't necessarily mean it, that the time board yeah. was necessarily set up for this. But, you know, because Cap did, you know, and granted, we don't know if Cap was saying that in that moment. It could have been from a previous moment, like, you know, the setup. So you never know. But if that is in the moment, and he's like, is this an old message? 
probably because Scott's been missing for like five years. Um, <laughs> so. I mean, I kind of want to watch it again. Yeah, let's do it. Uh, so yeah, those so of you who stick around, we're gonna watch it again. We'll kind of maybe comment, comment a little bit, commentate more. a little bit yeah. more. I try to just watch <laughs> the first one. I don't want to like take away. I don't want to miss any dialogue. Okay. So, I mean, this was kind of a depressing start. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Miss Ponce. If you find this recording, don't feel bad about this. If she's even alive. The journey is I know, right? I mean, I guess he would know. He was, you know. Just I mean, maybe not. Maybe he never made it back to Earth. Zero. Promise of rescue is more fun than it sounds. Yeah, because this is like him from Waterloo. Journeying from Titan. Ago. Well, you think? Maybe you think? It could oh, be him going I'm back into space. Because, like, why would he be out there without Nebula? Nebula's like, peace well, out! I <laughs> it's always you. The dusting of the Marvel Studios <laughs> logo. <laughs> and we've got, like, no Thanos in this trailer. Exactly what he said he was gonna do. He was a little bit of it. Yeah. <laughs> he wiped 50% of all living creatures. <laughs> Why is he so upset about, like, looking at a picture of Ant Man? He's he like, didn't I even know him. <laughs> <laughs> lost friends. Maybe, maybe Nebula is on the ship with them. Maybe we just didn't. She was on a different part when he was recording that. Maybe. We lost a part of ourselves. This is the fight of our lives. This is gonna work, Steve. I know it is. Because I don't know what I'm gonna do if it doesn't. They're gonna die. Like I say, I'm very underwhelmed with the title. Yeah, I mean, I feel like it could have been. Because a lot of people would... I mean, that was like the first thing that people speculated. And I didn't even like it then. Uh, I was just like... No. And I wasn't thrilled with Annihilation either. It would have been better. This is Scott Lang. We met a few years ago at the airport in Germany. Got a job really big. Is this an old message? Ant Man. Ant Man. I know you know. I know you know that. It's the front door. That's me. Can you buzz me in? <laughs> oh man. I mean. It's just yeah. I don't know. It's just. It's hard. There's no. Again, there's no context, so it's you don't know when things are taking place and what's happening when. Yeah, I mean we have no idea story wise. Like they didn't reveal anything <laughs> like story related, which we know, I mean at usually some point, they don't. Tony's in the first gonna trailer. be in the spa in space on you know, dying essentially. We don't know if that's beginning of the movie and then he somehow gets saved, or is that later in the movie when maybe they're trying to go back and, you know, yeah. fix things, do something. I mean I, mean, I feel like it would, I feel like it would make sense that it was them trying to, you know, leave Titan, but I mean, I thought, I just figured that Thor was going to be like, all right, well, I'm going to open up the back. I mean, I, I guess he wouldn't know where Weird. Tony yeah. was, but I don't know. That's just always how I thought he was going to get off, but. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, because Thor does have his fancy Bifrost opening <laughs> hammer now. Which comes in handy. Comes <laughs> yeah. Handy um, but I mean, yeah, no, no Thanos, so. Well, we saw his hand. <laughs> we saw the burnt up glove that we saw at the end of the last movie. Um, we saw a little bit of Hawkeye, so he's finally in it. Too. Yeah, everybody relax. <laughs> Hawkeye and Ant Man are and both has, in Avengers, and he and has the Ronin, Ronin. Uh, costume. Yeah, so, I, mean, I mean, I doubt, doubt that they're gonna call him that right. because there is a Ronin character, like. And they don't in just Guardians. call him Hawkeye usually; they just call him Clint. I know. So, um, or Martin, or yeah, they don't usually call each other by each other's code names. I mean, I know everybody kind of calls Cap Cap, but that's not so much a code name but like you know like nobody's like hey black widow they're always like natasha or romanoff or <laughs> it's gonna be interesting to see his role in it all i mean imagine this is just a theory but i imagine his family was probably uh, decimated by the snapping um so that's probably why he's gone a little bit like rogue and dark with like the costume and why he's coming out of retirement and all that He's like, screw my house arrest. <laughs> Although technically, at the end of Ant Man, Ant Man's house arrest is up, so I would assume that Hawkeye's that is probably was as also, well. But, but I mean, it uh, doesn't even matter. I don't think anybody's gonna come and arrest any no, of these I guys know. at this point. He's like, we're missing half the half of the world. Does it really matter what I'm doing? <laughs> um, but 
we didn't get to see Cap's uniform, like what it's gonna look like, and we don't, don't you know. know. Like I, imagine I feel like it'll probably maybe, but I feel like it'll probably at least you know. At the beginning, the beginning it'll probably be, be the, the, same, the same one. Like, but I imagine at some point he's gonna be getting. Or, a nice we're gonna have a one. scene of him like shaving his beard, <laughs> and then like putting on like a new uniform. It's just like the opening movie. It's just like this like like slow like montage with like a slow music and like. <laughs> He's Tony's just, floating out in space and like Cap's like shaving. There's, there's like the like classical music yeah. playing and he's just like shaving his beard and he's like, I'm home. <laughs> but I mean, yeah, I mean it looks like it looks like it's going to be a yeah, much different movie than Infinity War, which is exactly why the Russo brothers said they didn't want to call it Infinity War Part One and Part Two. This one looks like it's gonna be a little bit more slower, but I mean it's hard to tell by what we see, yeah. but I looks mean, like it's maybe gonna a little be... bit more story driven and a little bit yeah, more. Yeah, I feel like... like it's gonna have to be, at least in the beginning. Like it's gonna be a lot of like, like they need to show that emotional weight of like mm -hmm. they failed, like the well, world. That, is and gone. then like, yeah, you're you're coming home because they're in Wakanda at the end of Infinity War, so then they're coming home and then just being like Crap. We, yeah, there's like the I world mean, is gonna granted, be. Granted, Cap doesn't have he didn't have any family. I mean, you know, Bucky and like you know whatever, but and and, like, and he didn't have any. Off both of them. I was like, well, but I was like, he didn't have like any like family. Yeah. And as far as we know, Black Widow doesn't either. I mean, except um, for maybe Clint. Well, yeah, because in the in the uh, deleted scene for Civil War, she talks about how she went to Russia to find her parents, and then like she found their gravestones or something. So. Oh, uh, okay. Gone. Yeah. So it's like. Not a whole lot of them have family. They basically erased Bruce Banner's, you know, whole life from the Incredible Hulk movie. So it's like he doesn't have any interaction with any of those, like anybody. Um, oh, we didn't even see Tony had. Oh no! Oh, pepper, we saw Bruce for a second. Yeah, we saw him for just... a second. I was like, Tony has Pepper, and like that's you know. I was like, so not a. They, not, they don't really all have a lot of. Family. I mean, they're all each other's family. I guess is like kind of the. Yeah. The thing, but. <sighs> Oh, now, now I want another wait, one. I know, now the wait begins for the second trailer. Now the people are going to be like, at least the second trailer, you count. Oh, I know. It's like, all right, you got the trailer, everybody, like, calm down. Oh, I can't even like, wait to read the comments because I don't think this is, I mean, I think people are going to be happy, but at the same time, this isn't, I don't feel like this is going to satisfy, this isn't kind of what they wanted. I, I feel like they oh, wanted more of a trailer. Which is weird because like, I'm, like, perfectly okay with this. I, I mean, think, I'm okay. I, was, I, wanted, I just wanted a little bit more. I was, a little would have been fine if they never released a trailer. Like, just I mean, going true. in completely, but they were just like we're not releasing a trailer get over it everybody and then you just go in not knowing anything like that would have been nice i mean i could have just not watched this but that wasn't gonna I happen mean, yeah, like they released way. it so i'm gonna watch it um i just wanted like i just wanted that one money shot like in infinity war the the, or the first infinity war trailer where it shows like all of them running, running. towards the camera and everyone's and just like was, oh and then that wasn't even in the movie, but, in the movie. <laughs> but yeah like i just wanted like that one like the one money shot that i want from this movie is um, similarly to the first Avengers movie where like it kind of circled around them but this time I want them all standing in a line and I want them I want it to like be like their backs and then like Thanos is in front of them and it's just like it's just like going across all their backs that they're all like facing him and then just so like, is it like the walking dead when they're all on their knees facing Negan kind of <laughs> Kind of, yeah. But, yeah, like, that's just, like, that's the kind of, like, scene I want where I'm just, like, oh, like, they're all there, like, they're about to, like, you know. And then Thor comes in and lands on his head. And it's, like, <laughs> him and Captain Marvel Bring a little Ragnarok humor like, hey. to him. Um, but, I mean, we could go on. Oh, yeah, no Captain Marvel in yeah, this trailer see, either. Which I expected. They're not, I don't think they're going to reveal, at least, I thought, there might I, be, like, a small teaser, like, after Captain Marvel comes out and we've seen the end credit scene and see what's going to happen. You, They might, I feel like they'll wait until the movie comes out because they don't want to spoil how she's going to be in Well, the, just but th movie. but if they did it in the same fashion that they did the rest of the trailer, there may we may have, you know, they could have done it in the context where it's not like her coming in and meeting everybody for the first time, but like it could have just been her already there established within the movie, so therefore it doesn't spoil how she's there or why she's there, but she is just there. Well, but, I, yeah, but I don't think... I, think I, thought, I thought they were going to take a similar approach to, because Black Panther got a lot of screen time in the trailers and a lot of people thought, I mean, in Infinity War, a lot of people thought that was because they wanted to promote that character for the movie that comes out before you know Black Panther came out before Infinity War so I thought they were going to take you know a similar approach and have a, you know at least a little bit of screen time for Captain Marvel that way you know Marvel no, could be like I, go see this movie because she's that, in this one but I don't think they wanted to take away because you know this is about the original six you know I mean yes there's a couple extra Rhodey still survived and Nebula and Ant-Man and you know Captain Marvel obviously but like you know it, it was no surprise that the original six survived the snapping. So it's like, right. you know, I think they wanted to kind of focus more on them 
And, you know, maybe in a, the next trailer, or like I said, I think it might be a, like a little teaser, like little TV spot, spot or, something. or something where after the movies come out and you've seen that and you've seen the end credit scenes, you kind of know where her character's going into. So, you know, they might do like a little bit and be like, oh, look it, she's also in Infinity War. <laughs> or not Infinity War, Endgame, apparently. <laughs> um, don't like I don't like that title either. Uh, yeah, I, think they, I didn't like Annihilation either. That was... But I thought, like the I other thought one that being would have been thrown better. out. Um, so I mean, I don't have a better suggestion. Especially when the Russo but... brothers came out and said the title of Avengers Four has not it was not spoken in Infinity War because there was the, that huge rumor coming around that it was Endgame, and then Russo brothers came out and said no, it's not. Like it's, the title is has not, was not spoken in Infinity War, and then they're like it is. And I'm just what like, if at the end of the next trailer it has like a different title and like they just keep doing that and they're like you guys <laughs> oh. don't know which one. <laughs> I mean, that would, that and then would be when you trolling. see the movie, you're like, "That's what the title is." I mean, that would be that would be amazing. Like <laughs> the, the next, next one, one is Avengers like, Annihilation. Yeah. They're just like, "Wait, people are like, what?" <laughs> they're like, "Did they did they change it?" And they're like, "Oh, well, this is just one of one of the titles we're we're working on." Oh man, that that would be a good troll. Like, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> um, but yeah, so we could go on for hours talking about this two minute trailer. But if you stuck around this long, kudos. Um, but yeah, so. Let us know what you guys thought in the comments. What do you think of the title? Yeah. Are you as underwhelmed as we are <laughs> um, by the title? Let us know what you guys thought of the trailer. Uh, like, subscribe. Thank you for watching.